Hey, it's Aaron from GameWithThoos.com, and I am checking out Feria Chronicles of Gangana, which I'm saying that right, <laughs> for Nintendo Switch. I played a demo of this briefly some time ago on Steam. I had did, I, I started this game on the Switch recently, and I kind of went through like a tutorial well, not just like there's a tutorial level, but just like a set of levels lead you up to a boss that I suspect there was no real way of me defeating. I probably should have recorded all that stuff. I didn't. Hindsight is. Oh, I don't want to say that today, but, you know, when, when you look back on things. Um, yeah, you realize uh, mistakes you've made big and small. So I kind of went through a series of, of levels so teach you the game teach you how to play I'm not I'm, it's about um, it's a card game but it's like a it's a sort of an area majority kind of game where you're trying to just you're trying to get cards you're trying to get your your characters to the opposite side of the level where your enemy is and destroy them and they're trying to do the same thing with you so now that I've gone through all that there is a I'm going to use this term incorrectly because I don't often play these types of games like a a living card game kind of but digital living card game kind of thing going on here um, uh, kind of going on here but um, yeah so that's just some some background there so you gotta so by you just I lost but I was able to um, to acquire, I guess, like a full deck. So, okay, everything here is about going to the eShop apparently. Okay, so you can see there's a lot of, okay, I have, oh, okay, moving kind of quickly. Uh, I have a good number of packs. Now, a lot of this stuff, this premium stuff came uh, probably from the, the press key that, that I got, so. I don't want to mislead people and say you'll get all this with the game because honestly, I don't really know. What I do know is the game was trying to walk me through building my deck, which I don't really know how to do that just yet. I barely know like what I'm, you know, I, I need the tutorial on how to do that. So I kind of feel like rather than fumble my way through that, it'd probably best if I fumble my way through the gameplay because uh, okay, see this says requires level five. You look up in the upper right. I think I'm a level one. So not quite there yet. Which is okay. And my cat is very much in the way. But that is his way. Okay. So yeah, I could walk you through all the stuff by buying putting a deck together, which is important. Don't get me wrong. Uh, oh, see, I have to create a deck to continue. <laughs> I really should have recorded what I did yesterday because I don't have a clue as to what I'm doing here. Um, green starter, harness the strength of the forest. That sounds good. You can now assign specific cosmetic sets per deck. I don't, I don't care about all that kind of stuff. Uh, Set cosmetics. Select the cosmetic you want for this deck and then hit apply. I was fine with what I had, honestly. I thought that looked fine, but I don't know. This looks like group, sort of. Ah, <laughs> get it, Cap 10. I'll be here all week. Alright, can I? Yeah, I don't. Yeah, I, I don't know. I just want to show how the gameplay works. I mean, I'll be real. I never really get into this kind of stuff with like any game. So I just don't. And I'll just be completely frank, there's only patience. I just don't have it. I'm just like, oh, let me let me just play this game. I don't. I'm not a living card game. If, you know, I'm into board games now and stuff. I, I don't. I don't do the living card game stuff. Like either I can play this thing or. What so. 
Okay, so I have my green starter, 3.7, whatever. I mean, the deck building, don't get me wrong, it is important, but the actual gameplay is why you're playing the game. Like, what could be more important than that? You know, that's the reason, you know, why you launched the software is to, to play the game. Now, there might be a community of people who are just into building decks and they're playing the games that they're building them for. That is a whole nother thing. Okay, the cat is just... Ooh, I gotta calm down. Man. Okay. I play second. Um... I don't even... Uh... What does that even mean? Oh, we just swap it in. Okay. Yeah, this some of the, the mechanics here are a little bit different because this is like the real game. And although it's so, if you look in the if you look at a card, uh, let me show a better one. You look at the Steam Forge Enforcer. The number in the right is the number you need to play it, and you see that it's a six. If you look in the lower left where it says Aaron, and that's my name, I have three. I don't have enough to play this card. So also, if you look with at the, back at the card, the six indicates the amount of damage that this card can, can deal. And the five in the heart is your health. You guessed right. So if you see my little cursor move, see these little glowing orbs, you want to get an enemy. You want to get a character next to these because you can absorb more energy. Because you'll need more. I'll need more than three because you get three by default to play some of the more powerful cards to make it to that little to the wolf guy over there and kill him. So his health is ten minus twenty. I'm, I'm in a pretty good spot. If I press ZR, look at the lower right. I can pick different types of land with which to to build out certain uh, characters, certain cards need a, a certain type of land to actually to expand it. But right now, based on what I have for the Steam Forge Enforcer, I don't need anything. The Falcon Dive is just a, it's not a character, it's just an attack. It's just a one hit attack. Um, I don't know, explore, create two prairie and gain two. I think I'll mess with that. Okay, that that was nice. Okay, so if I look back in the if I hit ZR, you see my cursor moving in the lower right here. I can create one of like forest, I don't know, lava, sand. I guess this I guess this one just gives me one. I can forego putting on land, it's like ocean or water or whatever. I guess this is I can forego building land for another card or just get an additional uh, thing here. I'm not sure what's worth me doing though. Okay, so that's the end of my turn. I didn't put anybody on there, but I'm on my way. Okay, Tiki Totem. Okay. Structures can't move or fight back. Attack them with your creatures. Here we go. Well, I don't think I've ever seen this one before. Bloomspire. Last words. Add a random green card to your hand. It costs, costs three less. Nice. Okay, I'm going to put... I need a forest for this one. That's the only thing. I need to start getting some stuff out there, though. And see, this one has two. So I need two forests to put this one out. Um, which I don't have yet. You know, because life. So, definitely need to start getting some forests out there. But I can put out one at a time. That's what sucks. Um...
And that's all I can do. I need to build another another forest to put the bloom spire. I need to get a character out there. That's what I need. I'm not doing a very good job here. Okay, so the ancient boar, I can play that one. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it needs one forest or two of anything else. That's not what I wanted to do at all. What? Oh, that sucks. Oh, no, that's okay, actually. Okay, so I have the Steam Forge and Forcer there. Okay, that I'm fumbling a little bit, but that's okay. I wanted to... Because if you look at the ancient boar, it looks like it needs two of any type of land. Or one forest. So, that could be useful. Village Elder. That's where I draw a card. Okay. Put that village elder there. Uh, let's see. I feel like I, I should put forest out because the steam forge enforcer doesn't matter what it. It can go on anything, so it doesn't matter. I don't, it doesn't have a land requirement. I'm confused on why it's like forcing me to, I don't want to do any, I just want to build a piece of forest. I, I'm very confused right now. Just let me build some forest, man. That's all I want to do. Just, just all I want is a chip. Okay, there we go. Oh, I don't want to do that. Crap. I didn't want to do that at all. I wanted to... Oh, shoot. Oh, well. That was not... Yeah, I fumbled that completely, but that's okay. It was not what I wanted to do. Oh, I have the same thing. Yeah. Your turn. Okay. Oh, I'm just going to attack, because why not? And boom. Victory. So it would have been better if I could have started from the beginning to kind of see how it works. So my reward is the Queen's Assassin. Death Touch. With one health and one... Do they do anything else? I... That's more like a maiming touch or a, a slightly, you know... A, a, Maybe break the skin touch. I don't know. Uh, so collection. And this menu is going to take me back to stuff about customizing my deck and all that stuff. I'm not really like good at. Press A to remove any card from your deck. Now select this card to add it to your deck. Cool. Works for me. Okay, it's been added. Okay, back to missions. Treasure hunt address for success. I'll put a voucher. Yeah, this kind of stuff I normally don't even. I just ignore when it's like spend more money or do. I, I'm like, nope. But I'm trying. I am trying. So. Oh, those co op challenges. Interesting. I'm still level one. If you look in the upper right corner, you can see the circle is. It's like do more it's gonna complete and I'll be level two I need to do a lot of battling to get to level three though apparently I only have one deck here my green starter I'm fighting croc good old croc I have no idea how good or bad croc is I just I just wanted to say something Okay. Um, oh wow! Are those? I don't think I've ever seen these cards. 
Okay, taunt means that you have to attack an adjacent player. So if you you're around, if you're surrounded by two different, let's say you have Krog, the King of Ogres, you're adjacent to him, and an enemy to one of your other sides of your whatever the, the I can't think of the shape. It's not a hexagon because it's not eight, but you know what I mean. Uh, you will uh, automatically have to attack. Uh, a certain player. Okay. And we're going to put a guard there. So by doing that, I spent three to employ their services, but I should gain back the three I always get. And then an additional one because I was next to the thing. So, okay. So, okay. The farm boy is low cost to, uh, to employ his services. So now I should get an additional five on the next turn. I'll make the yak out of you. I sense dissension. Krog, you're not our king. That, that, hmm. You might, you might want to figure that out, man. Okay, so I can't play the tiki. Can't, why? I don't think the controls can be a little. Oh, it's just what I'm. Okay, because it wasn't let me. Okay, I want to see the tiki caretaker. Give a creature plus two or plus two. Okay, that's. Very specific. Okay, so I want to build a forest right there. Um, that's the only thing. I've, I I wish I knew how to like bump up how much you know the other lands because direct the grassland you can build two at a time, which can get you right to one of the little magic wells. But the forest, not so much. Forest is a, a one shot deal there. I do probably want to claim a little something. Okay, I'm going to end turn there. I want to put uh, put up a barrier on an enemy, enemy uh, an ally in between uh, the approaching whatever this thing is, the seven what is this enemy? The seven enemy, whatever. All right. Um, I'm going to build a forest here. Put this character there. Hmm. No, if I want to do that. It ain't much, but it is, you know, it's a barrier. It's something. Uh, okay, I have to put them on the forest, though, but I'm not ready to do that yet. So, all right. It's going to do it for my turn. Yeah, they were easily dispatched by that thing. Yeah, I gotta be a little more aggressive. His health is twenty-two, so I have a lot, a lot, lot of magic. But they are quickly approaching. Uh, oh boy! Turn that into a forest. Put that card down. So the thing is, it would be a, well, no, I would survive, actually. No, it would be a Pyrrhic victory. No, not for that one. He's dead. They knew who to attack. Punk. They knew they could take him out easily. Uh, so, the biggest threat. So, we're both dead, but, hey, what are you going to do? Put 
the ancient boar there. Okay. I should have put the, another farm boy next to the other, the other orb, but that's all right though. Did I say a war yak? A war yak. This is my yak of war. Seed sower. All right, we're gonna put this farm boy right here. He ain't gonna do much, but collect something maybe once if he's alive. Uh. Oh. Oh. Nice. Oh, and get you an adjacent one. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, and give a creature. Oh. No, that's not. And may as well hit him, because why not? Uh, why does it only let me... What does this do? Oh, full. Give a creature... Why can't I give... This doesn't make any sense. Oh, you have to put them a J... Okay, now I'm get I did not understand what that was trying to do. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Alright, okay. I'm hitting ZR. Okay. Okay. Oh, I have to pick the creature I'm getting too. Okay. Nice. Maybe I should have stayed there and given the wild boar that plus two. That might have made more sense. Hindsight. Okay, now I'm going to go to the seed sower. And I'm going to attack. No, you idiot. That's not what I wanted to do. No, it did, did more than tickle. Come on, dude. Let's be serious. Uh, give the boar plus seven. And I'm just gonna build another another forest here just because I can. No idea why. Oh, the mountainous reg uh, region is coming. I just skip their turn. Gift of steel. Giving the gift of a, a steel blade to a loved one. What can the Bloom Spire do? Add three random green cards to your hand. They gotta go on a forest though. Oh, they can go on that forest. <laughs> that tickles, dude. You're dying. Come on, son. Oh, I'm coming for you. I'm on my way. Um, what am I doing here? What? It just gets really fumbly. I don't. I, it's probably. I don't know if it's me or not. Just sometimes I'm just like, why am I locked into something? I don't know what I'm doing. I don't really want to build any more land here. What? What? What else am I doing here? What? I have no idea what I no idea what's going on here. Okay. I just build some forest there. Okay. Okay, that yak is backing up, okay. To put in the weaker yak. That okay, I'm I would Easily defeat that yak. 
But that's okay. Ooh, Silent Warrior. Okay, I'm gonna attack. Oh, I can't attack with them because they just got here. So I'll attack you. I gotta do something. I gotta attack somebody. Alright. And I need to build something. Don't know what. Uh, don't know why I did that. That was okay, sure. What what am I doing? I just wanna build, man. Just build. Stop it. Stop moving around. Alright, turn it down. And these controls are weird. Okay, so I got a boost. The War Yak. The most feared of all yaks. Uh, I'll let the Silent Warrior finish this off. Boom. Krog is defeated. Level 2. Good night, Krog. Okay, daily log reward, login reward, let's see. This was your first daily uh, reward. Login daily to earn increasing rewards, don't worry. Okay, okay so we'll go back to the missions. I mean, it feels like I hit buttons sometimes on the menu and it like is slow, it's like it takes a second. Okay, so Seifer, I believe, has 50 health. That's a whole nother situation there. We're just going to take a look at Seifer and we're, we're going to see if it's something that we're going we're gonna to involve ourselves in. It's funny, there's no mobile version of this game out, which is interesting. At least I maybe it's on iOS. I haven't seen it on Android. Because I feel like the touch screen might be best. Honestly, I'm not sure if this works with the touch screen. I'm assuming it does, but let me not assume. Let me check the website. All right, back to the game. Oh, okay, he only has 20 health. Oh, yeah. Oh, I get 50 XP for defeating him. Okay. Yeah, I'll go through this one. Let's see how this does. No reason not to. We're here. Enjoy your last breaths. Man, we ain't really started yet, dude. You over here talking trash, man. We ain't done nothing. I'm just gonna put her there so I can start earning a little bit more magic. Like a good prairie yak. And it's not a war yak, it's a prairie yak, but it's it's a yak nonetheless. Gotta have a good yak. Alright, now it's time to start building um some forest lands. I really wish I could build more than one at a time. I don't know how you improve on that, but it'd be nice. Wow. They are like really gunning for me. Okay. Uh, pretty aggressive here. Hmm. Uh, who do I want to put out to? Okay. Taunt means they're going to they're gonna fight right away. Remember, that's haste. Excuse me. Oh, why can't I put that one out? Come on. 
I have the f I have the f oh I need three crap. Oh well. I didn't realize I needed three forests for that one to go out. All right, okay. Oh boy. That wasn't nice. Okay, now I can put this one out. But I can't really attack with it yet because I just put it out. Boo. Okay. Defeated itself. Okay, now I'm up to 14. Um, okay, I don't think. Fortunately, both died. And. Put that there. So I got three of them now. Three of the four are mine. We coming for you. What, what, how much damage does this one do? Four? That's not that much. I may as well put it out anyway. All right, turns over. All right, um, Nobody's approaching all that fast, so I should probably move some of these folks over so I can surround. Do that. And yeah, so at least somebody's in front there. Um. So I almost got my I was so surrounded by my friends amongst friends. Yeah, they're, 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 they're coming. They are on the way. Uh, I need to destroy it. Destroy that. Ugh. I need to make that into a forest. I'm gonna send the seeds over there. I'm gonna do some damage. Hopefully. Yeah, they're gonna put something right there. Of course they would. So what can I do to like destroy their land so I can like get in there? Cause I don't, I need to find a way. I can't 
Uh -huh. Okay, now can I do it? Yeah, I don't know how this works. I'm just sending people out there, but I don't really have a plan on like, how do I like destroy lands and that kind of stuff. Uh, okay, stop it. What, what does this thing want me to do? What? No, Ugh. no, no, okay. Yes, I only know how I'm supposed to really. Okay, now we're both dead. Great. I can't. How do I get that one space? I honestly don't know how I'm supposed to do this. It's like because they built on it already, I can't. I don't know. Oh, okay. But now I'm dead, so I'm not really sure how that helped exactly. And I'll just send someone else to get slaughtered because they're going to do five damage. Didn't really think this out. <sighs> okay. I didn't think this one through. Okay, now we're both dead. Great. There we go. Okay. And if I could send, I wish I had a card I could give him a boost, but I don't. No idea why I sent the village elder out there, but here we are. Okay, with this farm boy, I'm not really going to be able to accomplish very much. I got all four. <laughs> Not for long, but. So I have a ton of magic, but the cards I just whack, so. Well. Ooh, what is that? I mean, this one card at a time stuff is. Ugh. <sighs> What is it asking me to do? Like, this is the part I don't get. Like, what? What?
everybody goes swimming. I don't know. It's not like this is dragging. I, I don't have good cards. I don't have cards. Let me get other cards. So I'm just stuck here. Everybody getting hate seeds and stuff. I don't know. I got trash. Good positioning, but if you don't have cards, you can't do very much. No, don't. Don't do that. What are you doing? Stop it. You can't undo anything either. Ugh. Frustrates me. Yeah, this card is pretty much dead. <laughs> I got a lot of magic, didn't did not play my card, I played too many cards. I couldn't get anybody powerful up there to do anything. Yeah, you're gonna die, so okay. I had a chance to win this one. Didn't didn't play it real well though. They have better card. I'm getting one card at a time. I can't I can't do very much. Gotta come right up the middle here. I'm just building other lands for the sake of building them. I don't even know what I'm doing at this point. Dang. Got defeated by Seifer. Broken wings. You can't play on broken wings. I meant broken string. You know what I mean. So anyway, I guess all the, the triumph had to ultimately end up in uh, in defeat at some point. So yeah, that's a little bit of uh, Faria. That's that's how the game works. Play better than I did. Uh -huh. Yeah, that is Faria. There's a lot more to it than that, but that is that's how you play. You know, sub that's how you play in a subpar fashion, that basically. So and I wish I could show it when I did it earlier. There are like puzzles you can do where like it, they'll set up a scenario for you where you have to defeat an enemy or something in like a certain number of turns. And that was sort of tutorial stuff to get you into understanding how um how the game works. So that's that was the adventure mode of battle and then two things I can't do because I'm only level two. But you know, we'll get there at some point. So yeah, that's a little bit of Faria for Nintendo Switch. I like it. I have a lot more to learn in terms of obviously my I need to go in and tweak my my deck because I got a whole bunch of farm boys and stuff that I can't really do anything with. So I mean, they're just meant to just take a sit somewhere in relative safety and absorb magic for you because they're not doing anything really offensively, not much or defensively. Anyway, that's going to do it for me. Thank you for watching. Take care. Wear a mask. Be blessed.